Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today in this video, we're gonna review the Wave OS. Uh, I exactly don't know what its version. So it is the Wave OS 4.7 official build for our Redmi Note 8 and Note 8T. As you can see here, it is based on the Android 11, and its security patch is also latest, which is the 5 August 2021. So today in this video, I'm gonna review it out, and I will tell you how you can install it so without any further ado let's get started So the ROM is pretty stable and there is no any single bug or issue. Every single thing is just working fine. Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, hotspot, mobile data, 4G, VoLTE, everything is working fine. And we get the MIUI camera pre-installed in this ROM. So you can also install any Gcam mode. So if you want uh, a video, a dedicated video on how you can install a stable and fully working Gcam on your smartphone then let me know in the comment section so the room is pretty stable and we do not get a load of uh, junky applications the application system is pretty much clean the room itself is also very clean as you can see here we don't have a load of junky applications we only have the necessary applications uh, i installed uh, some applications myself like express vpn firefox youtube studio etc and uh, by default we have a very clean application system now let's dig into the settings every single application and everything is working fine in this room so no need to be worried about anything the room is pretty stable so in the settings maybe it is visible to you and uh, let me enable the dark theme because dark theme really works pretty much awesome on this display so here we have the uh, internet and devices display in the display we have adaptive display brightness level screen timeout night light which is working fine you can change its intensity after it we have the colors from here you can change the color profile to natural boosted or adaptive you can also change the advanced settings then we have display cutout you can simply hide this notch by uh, setting up the cutout style and you can also manage the full screen application then you can manage the lock screen right from here you can also enable the always on display which gonna drain the battery quickly because we don't have the AMOLED display on this smartphone uh, then we have display in the display then we have some other settings like pocket detection tap to wake you can enable the blur you can enable the dark theme which works pretty much awesome as you can see you can enable or disable it it's totally depend on your taste then you can customize the status bar in the status bar we have some settings like quick settings pull down from the right side and double tap to sleep you can manage the icons you can enable the 4G icon, you can change the battery style right from here and you can also enable or disable the battery percentage you can also manage the traffic indicators after it we have the auto rotation, phone size, display size and screen saver after this we have the customization option in the customization option we have we only have some settings like you can change the wallpaper in the Wave OS wallpaper we have a load of wallpapers pre-installed and uh, from the style you can change the style because uh, we only have the default you can create your own by clicking on the custom button then you can change the grid of your launcher and home screen then you can you can choose the uh, clock, uh, clock for your lock screen as you can see here it looks pretty much awesome and then we have the sound the sound quality of this room is pretty much awesome and uh, here we have uh, vibration and haptics and all other advanced uh, sound options then we have apps and notification security in the security we have all security options like fingerprint is also working on screen locks are also working face unlock is also working and we, here we also have the 
app locker so no need to install any third party application locker after it here we have the privacy location battery the battery backup of this rom is really amazing as you can see here we also have the battery saver as you can see here we have the 94 percent battery and it is showing the estimate time about one day and three hours as you can see here the here we have the awesome battery backup you can also manage the battery manager and then we have the storage option accounts digital well-being google xiaomi parts now in the xiaomi parts we have really cool app uh, features as you can see here you can enable the me sound enhancer which would be helpful to enhance the sound quality and uh, you can also use the clear speaker if your speaker is not working well then you can collaborate your display colors so this is a really good uh, feature you can adjust the greens uh, reds and blues of your display and you can also enable the saturation and contrast uh, so you can boost the colors of your display then you can also uh, check the lcd features and at the end we have the system in the system we have accessibility digital will uh, sorry accessibility languages and input gestures in the gestures we have swipe three fingers to screenshot quickly open camera system navigation bar and you can also hide the navigation bar pill right from here as you can see here i just hidden the navigation bar pill to get the immersive full screen display then we have prevent ringing uh, power menu you can enable the advanced power menu as you can see here adaptive playback quick touch then we have date and time buttons in the buttons we have enable uh, advanced restart and playback control then we have backup reset option multiple users and in the about phone section you can check your rom version which is the wave os 4.7 and uh, the rom is pretty stable and uh, this is not the official build uh, sorry i made mistake at the start of this video i said this is the official build so this is not the official build and uh, the ROM is pretty stable and red version is 11 security patch is latest 5 August 2021 and uh, here we have this talk kernel you can also change uh, the kernel by installing a custom kernel using TWRP recovery so the ROM is pretty stable recommended 100% recommended ROM so if you want to install this ROM on your Redmi Note 8 or Note 8T, uh, your bootloader should be unlocked and TWRP or any custom recovery should be installed on your Redmi Note 8 or Note 8T. If you have not installed any custom recovery yet, then you can watch my previous video from the link in the description and also from the i button. So after downloading the ROM, uh, just download the ROM if you want to install it. Just download the ROM, no need to download GFs manually because GFs are already included in this ROM. Download the ROM, restore it in your device and reboot your device into any installed custom recovery. Right now I am using the TWRP recovery and if you want me to make a dedicated video on any other custom recovery then let me know in the comment section. So let's allow the modification from here first of all we need to wipe the previous rom old rom just to go to the wipe click on advanced wipe from here wipe everything except the internal storage and sd card just wipe from here after wiping go back to home click on install and now uh, you need to click on that rom and uh, just flash it out and the rom will be installed on your device so this was the video of today uh, i hope you like this rom if you want to install this rom you already know what to do so hope you guys like this video if you really did hit the like button don't forget to subscribe my channel keep supporting thanks for watching peace